Hi friends, this is Dr. Rohan Virani, your mentor for basal implants. Lot of doctors are creating unnecessary stress about retrievability. What I mean by that is, I'm going to show you a case to prove my point over here. Just come closer, show this x-ray. So as you see on this uh, case over here, upper is all on four, the classical technique. And you can clearly see there is lot of extensive bone loss over here. And you see the lower jaw basal implants, one piece implants okay and mind you this x-ray you see the bone formation this is a 2.5 year follow-up x-ray now you know lot lot of times we tell we need retrievability we need retrievability but what about peri implantitis we are using rough surface implants and the implants are failing and we are talking about retrievability just come over here i will show you the patient in the patient's mouth urmila ji just if it open mokale bite bite okay now just first focus on the lower jaw over here there is no attached gingiva there is absolutely no attached gingiva okay and because they're all smooth surface implants there is nothing like peri-implantitis over here and now you see in the upper jaw okay you can see the extensive peri-implantitis over here see this extensive peri-implantitis this thread exposure in almost most of the implants over here so a question to all of you who are watching this video is we focus a lot on retrievability but we forget that the essence is the implant and especially the patients who are having lack of attached gingiva lack of bone we may do some extensive bone grafting procedures but what about the long term i want to know your views on this particular case and let me know in the comment box what do you feel regarding the choice of implants basal or conventional please give me your opinion below the in the comments thank you